Tell me about your tell me about motherhood. What you do seem you to be to enjoying know? that. I really am. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> I really am. It's it's Tell me about that. You know when you say tell me about it and I host mom's The everything. whole faces of it. All the faces from the beginning? Oh, no. <laughs> Let me tell you that labor. <laughs> no, not, not the faces, like the faces of it, you know. Just tell me the most fascinating thing about it. The most fascinating thing is uh, what every everything about it is fascinating. From just how she is she really has a personality and you can tell the personality she she was singing when she was one i know i keep saying my baby is a genius but she really is she's 18 months and she counts from one to ten uh -huh. okay just say uh -huh. <laughs> she counts from one to ten she knows everyone in the family by name she's okay. 18 months of course she can't say Sylvia, like Sylvia, but she says something that sounds like Sylvia. So, do you understand? Mm -hmm. And just watching her grow, seeing how much just one tiny human being can have so much influence on your life. It's not an ex experience that I can put into words, really. Unless you have specific questions, I really don't know how to answer that. I can just say that it's more than I expected, and I love it. Okay. When I was leaving the office to come for this interview, one of the writers in the office, she's called Sue, eh? Yeah. She told me to ask you, why don't you ever show her face? I don't show her face for a couple of reasons. Oh. Um, one of them is, of course, the internet is not a very safe place. And I'm very protective of things that I, I love. Even my parents. I don't want to put my parents' photos up. But nobody ever asks that. <laughs> just want to know why you're not putting up your baby. Yeah? Anyway, yeah. The internet is not a very safe place. There are very many cases of kidnappings, and pedophiles. And if anything happened to her because of my, I don't want to say negligence, but because of my actions, then I wouldn't be able to forgive myself. There's also, um, the internet also has uh, very many mean people. Mm -hmm. So I may put up a photo that I think is I think is funny of my baby making a funny face. Because mm -hmm. it's a meme that hurts my feelings. Mm -hmm. you understand? Mm -hmm. There's also the thing of um, I don't know what kind of adult she will be. She may grow up to be very personal. Mm -hmm. I mean, very private. That's not the word. Very private. I love I would be responsible for all her baby pictures and all her growing ups and her in a in a in swimwear, all those things being on the internet. So I don't want to make the, that decision for her. And I'm not saying I will never ever put up a picture of my daughter anywhere. I mean, you'll never see her photo anywhere. But I just want to try as much as I can to protect her while I can. Uh, since you... It's been 18 months, eh? Yeah. Since you got her. Do you think, has that affected your career in any way? It has affected my career, but... Most people think that when you have a baby, your career is dead. But I keep saying, it's a baby. It's not a death sentence. It's a baby. And guys don't really usually uh, know this. But they come with their own blessing. Like I wouldn't have this show that's on primetime TV if I didn't have a baby. Because now I'm talking about motherhood. No, no. So it, didn't, it affected my career, but in a very good way. Because right now it directed me to where I was, I'm supposed to go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Tell me more about the baby's father. What do you want to know? <laughs> mm. Like earlier mentioned that you are the one, your relationship is a bit of a, of a, it's not that open. Yeah. Is it a choice you guys made or? Yes, definitely. Um, I said this the other day, I was on an interview on TV, we are, we are a young family and there's a lot of scrutiny that comes with being a celebrity couple. So it's, it's a choice to kind of try to protect ourselves from that kind of scrutiny, again for as long as we can or as much as we can. 
and I use this uh, reference like when a building in Adyengwa and it's still in, in its initial stages of babies you know? you see these ma gunias that yeah, I know. cover buildings mm. so it's kind of like that you know, and I just want to protect that unit that we have because once again I really value and treasure family and now this is my family so that's the reason how do you guys meet? Huh? How do you guys meet with How? Yeah. Sometimes you I approached him. How? <laughs> but I didn't approach him, approach him in that way. I was starting to wonder just how thirsty you can be, Brenda. No, 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 I didn't approach him in that way. Mm. <laughs> but uh, he, he used to do many performances in universities at the time. He was doing a lot of university performances. And I was in school and I was a huge fan. And I had only just started um, acting on Changing Times, maybe a couple of months in. Mm -hmm. no, no. So he was coming over for an anime for a, a performance in school, and I remember just tweeting. So I just tweeted that I can't wait for an anime performance, and I had, I had uh, plated short, short braids so that I could shake him, like he shakes them. So I just tweeted that, and then that's how we got to talking. Or he DM'd you later? No, he didn't DM. <laughs> it was very open because, like I, like I said, it wasn't like that. Mm. So, to look at Nongea too. So, you guys started off as friends? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, after I, how long? I started off as a fan. Ah. Uh, yeah. So, how long did you stay in the friend zone before he finally. I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember. I can't remember. But it was a wonderful time. How is it being with him, though? How's it been? With him. How is it being with him? It's good. He's a very different human being. Mm. He's What's a the differentiating factor? Huh? What is so fascinating about him? What's fascinating? <laughs> He's the father of my child. That's pretty fascinating. Yeah, we are getting to that. Eh? But before you guys settled uh, on having a baby. Yeah. Of course, it was not his you know, maybe baby making skills that you saw first. Of course, he saw something else. And that is what I'm asking. What is so, like, once you guys, what made you make that decision that, okay, we need to stop now being friends. We really now need to start dating. I can't speak for him. I'm, I'm asking you. But for me, for yeah, <laughs> I can't speak for him. But for me, I found him very, he's very intense. He's, um, he's very smart. And just, I could list qualities all day, but the most Im important one is that I'm very comfortable with him, and I can, we can talk all day. And it's just, it's the little things that make you just know. So I just knew, I guess. Yeah. And how is he performing as a dad? He's there are a lot of good. guys when they come first, you know, babies are not easy to take care of. <laughs> yes, they are. Okay, they're not. <laughs> he's a he's a good dad. He is. Ah, yeah. Okay. That's good. And then does he have an issue? I also before I came here, I stalked your Instagram. Eh? Yeah. There's a lot of Nick Mutuma on your Instagram. Yeah. Very little of Giuliani. But he I doesn't just have, explained this. They have an issue with that. Even yeah, though you no. guys okay, so I understand when you guys need to keep it. You are young family, you don't like a lot of attention. Yeah. I have an answer to your question. Uh, I, let me continue. Okay. I don't think you do. Because <laughs> when I checked his Instagram, yeah. you are there. There's Who's so Instagram? many his Instagram. Who's now? Giuliani. Okay. There's a lot of Brenda in Giuliani's Instagram. Is it's there? Not, yeah. No, there's not. Yes, there is. You know. So when I checked his, then I compared it with yours. There's very little of him in yours. A lot of you Okay, he doesn't put captions, he just puts you there. He never really says a lot of things about it. But he makes sure that, you know, you are seen. But on yours, there's a lot of Nick Motuma in it. Explain more about that. He doesn't have an issue with that, he's good with this. But there's nothing to have an issue with. Because when I put up me and uh, Nick, what's the caption? 
or rather what's the context behind the picture it's always something we're working on because we've been working on the romantic comedy together mm -hmm. so as we're doing that you have to post up your progress so as people want to see what you're doing mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. immediately after that we started working on blaze the blaze project together and again, we had to keep on posting things to keep people updated. So that's the reason why. I don't just wake up in the morning and decide, let me post a picture of me and Nick. It doesn't work like that. Uh -huh. We're not that much of boys. <laughs> no, no. It's, there's this quote that says, we've become a generation that's very intent on documenting very little documenting so much and accomplishing very little but what i document on my instagram is the work that i do does that make sense uh -huh. so when i'm posting uh, nick and i it's about work it's not because we're boys uh -huh. okay okay makes sense